Cashmith. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Keith Peterson. First assignment for Keith Peterson tonight, DC. Before that tail of the tape, I'll let you finish on that Devontae Smith thought. Yeah, I was talking to Devontae Smith, and I asked him about the Achilles right. uh, rehabilitation. And I said, do you take Sir, something you from right? Kevin Durant? Sir, he right. goes, no. Fight. Kobe Bryant came back and was still considered one of the greatest of all time. After that injury, he feels like he was never hurt now as he goes into this fight. He feels fantastic. Yeah, said he had to learn to walk again after the ruptured Achilles which uh, obviously would feel a bit strange, but thought to be one of the hardest hitters and brightest prospects in the UFC lightweight division. And he is back in action tonight against Justin James. Smith is minus 360 as the favorite in the black. And if you're Justin James, you're, you're excited because you're not getting blasted with those big kicks like Gabriel Benitez hit him with last fight to start the fight, right? So when you think of the hands, you kind of... <laughs> appreciate not getting those kicks landed on you right as the fight starts. James has a gift to getting past that reach, yep. finding his way into the pocket to land that left hook or a big right hand. But Smith has the opposite advantage where he's very good at staying lengthy, staying on the outside, using his jab and his right hands to create space and then clip you hard on your way in. Smith is showing really good patience, staying outside, head moving, shoulders moving, pops the jab from a distance. You know that he's got a smaller guy in front of him, a little bit shorter, so he can fight at his range, but James is landing. USC Fight Pass invites you into the world of combat sports, the ultimate source, the immersive experience, the always-on network with authentic content, in-depth original programming, and unique access to live events. It's all in one place as the global combat sports premier streaming service, USC Fight Pass, always in your corner. Smith just landed a beautiful jab that put James back on his heels. He tried to throw it again. James came over the top with a nice overhand right. But boy, you can see the power that Smith possesses when he sits on that jab. Yeah, it doesn't take much when Devontae Smith lands. Showed that in his UFC debut in Denver a few years ago. He got Julian Arosa inside of a minute. And he said about that, right? Making that debut and... Having all that attention that came with it, he said he got lost in the sauce a little bit. Like, you, you start to overvalue who you are in the sport of mixed martial arts when you have that instant success as a young fighter. He's really kind of caught himself now and feels like he's back in his lane. We'll talk about getting some attention. Of course, the Heisman Trophy winner this year was Devontae Smith with an A on the end of it. <laughs> And, 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 and our version in the UFC here says his Instagram is getting all sorts of messages. Yeah. Have a good game. Hope you're feeling good after the injury. Hey, Devontae Smith is the man. I mean, <laughs> my goodness, watching that dude play football, it is absolutely insane. Cool. You can see Jane's having a tough time getting past that jab of Smith right now. That's And Smith's being very, very patient with it. He's throwing it out there, waiting until he can really land it, have Jane's explode in, use some of that energy before he starts landing the bigger shots. Tactical. Normally when you get the taller guy and the shorter guy... Oh, oh that hurt him, the right hand. That's Jane's right hand that you got to watch for at all times. And then he switches. He'll throw the right hand, switch to southpaw, and come with an overhand left. He, that's how, what he does to make himself long. Nice low kick. Big moment early for Justin Jane's. That would benefit Devontae Smith here, right? Instead of jab, 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 jab. You got to break up the sequence because Jane's now kind of has a beat on that. And he's throwing the overhand right, right over the top of that jab. A high kick will help with that right hand. And that's what he's looking to throw. That's what you're seeing Smith do well. He's throwing that left kick just enough that now Jane's has to defend the left kick and can't throw his right hand at the same time. Oh, dips in, changes levels, and just out of the range of that big shot. Is there a cut under the right eye of Justin Janes that I see? I'm not sure. Well, there's some red there. It's off that jab, man. That jab is popping. Catches him with a left hook that time to Smith. Under a minute to go first round. It's a combination. That's the first time Smith has let two jabs go in a right hand behind it. That was fast. That was a nice combination there by Devontae Smith. <laughs> Hey, he's gonna walk into that car. Yeah. All right? Ah! 
James remains on the outside. Smith pressures forward. Hammers away while his leg. With his leg in the air, I think he hurt him. Yeah, I mean, oh, James is just heat. swinging now. <laughs> he just blitzed him the second he grabbed a hold of that leg, just started unloading on James. Final 10 seconds of round number one. Smith right in his kitchen. Second round is coming up. Slow it down. Take a seat. I took that kick. Hurt. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. A little water. Hey, we got to make sure we don't stay in his range. And let's get your hands on him, right? Press him to the cage, right? Especially now that he thinks you're wanting to strike. Press him to the cage. Look for your trips. All right. Right? Yes, sir. He's a good striker. Yeah. He's, he's not good off his back. Yes, sir. We just got to get him there. Yes, sir. Okay? Yep. Okay. Sure. Slow it down. There you go. Great work, great work. Oh, yeah. We're good. We're good. Fans, check out UFC 259 Best Seats at the Apex Sir, Sweepstakes right? Sir, presented right? by Howlerhead. Be the first ever UFC fan to experience a live pay-per-view event inside the UFC Apex here in Vegas. We're giving away a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity for one lucky fan and a guest to attend UFC 259 in March. Go to UFC.com slash best seats for more details. Restrictions apply. Very smart there by James, getting close. Straight. Oh, wow, what a, what a reversal there by Smith. That's a big-time strength from Devontae Smith. Full side now. His feet away from the cage. Let's turn his head. Beautiful. A deep breath here, Devontae. Cross legs. Two damage with your left hand. Get the, the deep breaths from the bottom from Justin James. Left, Smith continues breath, to work and stay busy on top. And then you're going to do damage with your left side hand. Known for the knockout, just one win by submission in 10 victories for Devontae Smith. Has never gotten his hand raised in a decision. Watch the wall walk. Watch the wall walk. Three feet away from the cage. Three feet away from the cage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Third one. Hey, left elbow. Step over that. Step over that arm and crucifix if you'd like. And move his feet away from the cage. And you hear the voice of Mark Montoya in the corner of Devonte Smith, who he works right in front of as they guide him through the paces on the ground. Good pressure by Devonte Smith here. Yes, beautiful. I mean, he's just in that side mount, which we talked about earlier, isn't always the best, the easiest to keep, but. He's got that good top pressure, and James is trying to use the fence to create an angle, but he's keeping him parallel with the fence, so he can't really use it as well as he'd like to. Smith just trying to wear out some of that energy of James in this position here. And you know, you wonder, why doesn't he just get up and just throw a bunch of elbows and punches? Yep. Well, the second he gets up and starts doing so, James got the space he needs to explode up. And don't forget, he's got 40-something amateur fights. This guy has tons of experience, James. So you can't give him an inch. You gotta take anything you can get. Smith looked to hurt him in, at the end of the first round, right? So, oh, beautiful slide right into the mouth there. Wow, dominant position here with two and a half minutes to work. That was beautiful. I mean, he didn't create space there. He literally just slid his knee across the top like a knife through butter, man. He just went over the top on top of James, and now he's in the full mountain just going off on him. Yes, keep doing damage. Hey, don't forget your elbows. Flatten, go under his underarm. Trying to put his hooks in here. Now, if you're James, right, this is not the worst position, right? Because you know that you have not seen as much submission threat from Devontae Smith, so you take a chance. I'm not saying Devontae Smith can't go find a choke, but if you look on the tape, you didn't see him submitting people, so this is better 
to him being in the mouth, just landing big punches on. He's slapping. Him. Oh, heavy swell. Oh, he's gonna get it. Look at that too. And now he's trying to put that right arm under the chin. If you're James, you gotta sit. James is not fighting the top hand though. James is done. That's it, man. That is tight. It's not all the way, but it's deep. He's gonna get out. Look at that. There it is. Chains on top for a moment. Smith explodes out as James try to keep him on the ground. James wants to stay on the ground. Stand up. And Devontae Smith says, Oh, look at the bruising on his eyes. Dance, yeah. Under the left eye. That is, oh, oh my man. goodness. Ooh, Ooh, sir. Smoke is oh, sir. and that might be enough to end the fight. So Keith Peterson Doctor. immediately takes a look and calls time, and he's going to have the doctor in here. Must have been one of those elbows that landed. It looked like he was slapping him right there. And you can almost see it like growing. Yeah, I can, yeah, I can. Oh, and Keith Peterson calls it off. Justin James wanted close. to keep going, as you would expect. But it's going to go down as a TKO victory. Welcome back, Devontae Smith. I mean, you know. I mean, it's hard to argue with that damage. Yeah, James is a fighter, and he's going to want to go out there on the shield. But there's no reason to. You know, he was getting beat up. He was behind two rounds, and look at his eye. I mean, it's completely close. I was a great. All right, we're going to get out the, the telestrator for DC again. Yeah, this started this whole sequence, right? Look right here. I'm sorry, I did not mean to do that. Look at the leg back here of Devontae Smith. He's going to hook, and he's going to lateral drop him, taking him back in this direction. I mean, I'm all messed up right here on my telestrator. Let it roll. Look at that left leg. It's behind. Watch him arch back into that lateral drop. That was beautiful. All he did, block the leg and use his momentum to lateral drop him back over the top of that leg in order to secure that takedown, which did lead to all the damage from the top that ended up losing, winning him the fight. Pushing down on the elbows, short elbow gets him right here. He starts to post off the front of the face and then just dropping the elbow and then he ended up getting his back and he was slapping him and punching him, just hitting him directly on the eye. Beautiful win by Devontae Smith. And there's Keith Peterson consulting the doctor and then waving it off. Justin James wanted to keep going. The guy's a warrior. Devontae Smith, good to see a smile back on his face and have him back in the octagon, healthy, competing. And he gets the job done with a TKO victory in round number two. We're just about set to make it official. And for that, we send it back to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, at three minutes, 38 seconds of round number two, the doctor has called a stop to this fight. Declaring the winner by TKO, Devontae King A. Smith. So Devontae.